If you search for AI influencer on YouTube, our channel's video shows on top. The same thing happens when you search for WordPress website or AI movie. Can you guess why? We do this by using the right keywords in our video and also creating the best video possible. Finding the right keywords can be a little tricky. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to find and pick the right keywords to rank your video on YouTube. Knowing the correct way to do this is very important as the right keywords can significantly boost your views and even your subscriber count. However, if you choose the wrong keywords, it can lead to poor video performance. So after watching this video, you'll have a step-by-step -step guide on how to do keyword research the right way. Also, stick around till the end because there's a bonus tip that you definitely don't want to miss. I'm Brian from Website Learners and let's get started. To rank a YouTube video at the top, the first thing that we need to do is keyword research. Now, what exactly is a keyword? In simple terms, a keyword is a word or a phrase that people type into search engines like Google or YouTube to find information. For example, if someone wants to learn about baking a cake, they might type in how to bake a cake. That's a keyword. So keyword research is simply the process of identifying the most popular keywords which people are searching for. But why is keyword research important? Because when you know what people are searching for, you can create content that matches those searches. This increases the chances of your videos appearing at the top when someone searches for those keywords. Now, there are different methods to do keyword research. First, we're going to see how to use YouTube to find keywords. So I'm going to show three simple ways to find the keywords from YouTube. And guess what? You won't need any special tools. The first method is to search for keywords directly on YouTube. Just go to YouTube and here enter a topic that is related to your channel's niche. I'm going to type write a blog. And once you do that, and you will see the most searched keywords related to your topic. Now click on the one that is most relevant to the video that you want to create. And you will see different videos that are ranking for those keywords. Now check the number of views you see by each video here. And you can see a video here that has got a lot of views. From this, you can understand that this particular video has done these three things correctly in their video. Number one, the title of the video. That is, they have kept the right title for the video, which gets the maximum clicks. And this has resulted in the high number of views that they have received here. Number two, they have a good thumbnail. And number three, the actual content inside the video was good. So more viewers watch this video compared to the other videos. So when a video has high number of views, they have done all these three things correctly. Now, what can we learn from this? The first two are called the packaging, which means that this is the thing that a viewer sees on the outside before even deciding to watch the video. And the third is called the content, which is what's inside the package. So at this stage, you will focus on the packaging and see what kind of packaging that is the title and the thumbnail has worked well. Once you have found a video with high view count, you can try to figure out what particular video is promising. You can note it down. And so depending on this, you can plan for the video and the content in a similar angle. So once you come up with a similar angle for your video, it can also attract the same set of users. Okay, so that's the standard method you can use to find the keywords on YouTube. There's another clever method that you can use to find even more keyword ideas. So let's see the second method, which is to find keywords on YouTube. And that is by using the alphabet method. Let me show you how it works. Just enter a topic like we did before and enter space. Then type any letter of the alphabet you want. For example, I will type A. And as you can see, we got suggestions that contain the popular keywords starting with the letter A. Similarly, if you type B, you will see the suggestions where the keyword starts with the letter B and so on. You can do this for each alphabet to find even more keyword ideas. So let's type W and see if we get any good suggestions. As you can see, this suggestion matches the type of content that we create. So let's click on it. And these are the top ranking videos for this keyword. Just like we did before, let's copy the titles from the first three videos and paste them in the same Google document that we used before. The alphabet method is great for generating a variety of ideas, but there's one more technique that can help you dig even deeper to find the perfect keywords. So let's check out the third method, which is called the asterisk method. Let me show you how it works. First, type in your topic into the search bar and then add an asterisk after at least the first two words. For example, I'm going to add it here. Now check out the suggestions that pop up. You'll see different words filling in the place of the asterisk. You can move the asterisk around in your topic to get even more different ideas. Look at this one. It's similar to the type of content that we create. So I'll click on it.
and again copy the titles of the first three videos and paste them in the Google Doc. So these are the titles that we got from three basic techniques that we used for long tail keyword research. These are the titles that ranked high on YouTube and contains a main keyword. So go ahead and use the title which is related to your content. Okay, now we've seen the manual keyword research using YouTube. Next, let's see another method which is going to speed up the entire process and is also going to let us come up with unique video ideas which doesn't exist on YouTube yet. I'm going to show you some powerful tools that will help us discover high potential keywords with low competition and using those keywords, we're going to generate some unique video ideas that can get a lot of clicks and views. By combining these tools, you'll be able to create compelling video titles that stand out from the crowd and gain more views. You can also rank your videos for these keywords more easily compared to other keywords. So first, let's see how to identify these high potential keywords with low competition. So to do that, we're going to use a tool. And to get the tool, just click the link in the description and it'll take you to this page. This is the tool that we are going to use to find the keywords. Now to find the keywords using vidIQ, we are going to do three simple steps. The first step is to sign into vidIQ. So to do that, just click here and sign in with your Google account. Great. Now that you are signed into vidIQ, let's link our YouTube channel here to get the keywords. So let's go to the second step, which is to link your YouTube channel. Let's start by clicking here. Then select the Google account of your YouTube channel. Click allow. And it's done. We have successfully linked our YouTube channel to vidIQ. So let's go to the last step, which is to find the keywords. To find them, just go to keywords and search for the topic of your interest. For example, I'll search for blog AI. And as you can see, we have got the search volume and the competition score here. The search volume is high, which is good because it means that many people are searching for this keyword. However, the competition is also very high, which means many other YouTube channels are trying to rank for this keyword. We need to find keywords which are related to our topic that have high search volume and a low competition score. So to get related keywords, click here. And as you can see, we got a list of related keywords along with the search volume and the competition score. Just select the keywords that have high search volume and medium to low competition. For example, this keyword has a high search volume and a medium competition, which means we can rank for this keyword. So let's select it by clicking here. Similarly, let's select all the keywords which have a similar score. Okay, once you have selected the keywords, we need to copy them. So to do that, just click here and the keywords will be copied. We will be needing these keywords later. Let's paste them in a notepad. So now we have got all the related keywords to our topic. All right. In addition to the related keywords, you can also find some keywords that directly match our topic. So to do that, just click here. And as you can see, all these keywords match the topic that we entered. And all of them have our topic blog AI in common. So just like we did before, select all the good qualifying keywords, then copy them and paste them in a notepad that we use to paste the related keywords. All right, so now we've got a bunch of keywords that can perform well on YouTube. Now, as I told you earlier, once we have the keywords, we can use these keywords to generate unique video ideas that can get a lot of clicks and views. So next, we're gonna use another AI tool to generate compelling video titles. Just click the link in the description and it'll take you to Gravity Write. Gravity Write is an AI tool that can help you generate various types of content. All right. Now to generate long tail keywords and titles for your YouTube videos, let's click on YouTube tools and select title and thumbnail ideas. Here you can enter all the keywords that we copied from vidIQ. And click create content. And as you can see, Gravity Write has generated a list of titles that contain the keywords that we provided. These titles will perform well on YouTube because they have low competition and a high search volume. Also, they are very attractive, hence more users will click on it. So go ahead and use the title you like for your video. So this is how you can find high performing keywords that will help your videos rank high on YouTube. Alright, now you know how you can make your videos rank high on YouTube with effective keywords and attractive titles. But remember, the first thing the audience notices about a video is its thumbnail. So having an attractive thumbnail is just as important as using the right keywords. You can check out this video in which I'll show you how to make thumbnails for your YouTube videos using AI. 
But wait, that's not all. I've got a bonus tip for you where if you're struggling to find new ideas for your YouTube channel, VidIQ has an amazing feature that can help you find trending video ideas for your niches. Let me show you how. Go to competitors and here you can see a list of channels from our niche. These channels are our competitors and they have been manually added by me. To add your own competitor channels, just click here to add them. To get video ideas, we'll start by choosing a competitor's channel and let's pick this one. So just click here, select view channel on YouTube and it'll take you to that YouTube channel. Now click here, select view trending videos and as you can see, we have got a list of all the trending videos of this channel. Now we can use any of these video ideas and make an even better video for our channel. And that's how you can find new video ideas for your YouTube channel. So that's it guys, this is how you can do keyword research for YouTube. But before we wrap up, I want to remind you about two fantastic tools. First, Gravity Write, an AI writing assistant that generates high quality content for all your needs. And then Webspace Kit, a web hosting platform that makes it simple to launch and build stunning WordPress sites. Be sure to check them out using the links in the description. Thanks for watching. And if you like this video, do give it a thumbs up and remember to hit the subscribe button. I'll see you in the next one. Until then, take care. Bye bye.